what's good what's good what is good my stars are short back again with another video and today i'll be letting you guys in on a locals secret so shh don't tell anybody so what is this locals secret you ask well it's a website called house seats now house seats is a members only website a side note you guys there is a membership fee it is once a year and then after that all of the shows that they have to offer are free and you have to have a nevada id in order to sign up it's a website that is offering tickets for all different types of shows offered in Las Vegas. Now I also have a referral link, so I'll be putting that in the description below and you guys can use that link to sign up for house seats for your membership. And they also have different packages for their memberships. You can get one that has up to two tickets. So when you go to book, you can book up to two tickets or you can book up to four. And they also have upgrades available for each membership. Now I will be showing you how to work the website and the one that I have is for two tickets. Also another side note, Make sure you read the fine print whenever you book a show because if you can't make it and you already booked it, they will charge you and you have a possibility of losing your membership. Once you log on to House Seats, this is what you'll see. These are just all of the shows that they have to offer, typically within a seven day period. And then you can sort it by the date that the show comes or just the shows that they have to offer. Or you can do a calendar view, which will show you all of the shows that are happening today, right now, and it gives you the times. You can book multiple shows. However, if they overlap, it won't allow you to book the second show. I typically like to keep mine on sort by date, and that way I could see like the little icon of what the show actually is, and it tells me like the day, or you could view it as a grid or a list. Typically, I prefer a grid as well, but the list works too. It also gives you a little preview of their fine print, and it tells you the day, the time, and its location. Now, when booking the shows, it's very important to read the fine print because sometimes it'll say whether or not parking is free and if you have to pay for parking or if you have to park elsewhere. It'll also tell you the location because even though they do offer a lot of shows that are on the strip, they also offer a lot of shows off the strip or in downtown Las Vegas. So it's very important to know where you're going and when you need to get there by because sometimes they send you your tickets through your email or you have to pick them up and you have to go early to pick them up. Now the cool part about House Seats is that you can also see the previous shows that have been offered on House Seats while you've had your membership that you just did not book. So it's basically shows you've missed and it tells you all of the different types of shows that they've had to offer but you didn't book it. So we have Carrot Top, a Derek Hugh event, Donny Osmond, Gordy Brown, Illuminate, Fabulous the Show. So it really just depends. MJ Live, Penn and Teller, like some of these shows come once in a blue moon and other shows are on here all of the time. Like I said, that's why it's very important that you just keep checking your house seats because I'll be honest, I check mine every time I wake up and then a little around like noon because sometimes the shows will change or they'll add more throughout the day, it just depends. But now I'm gonna show you what it looks like to actually book a show. So I'm just gonna go back to the grid and I'm just gonna select a random show. For here, I'll pick Rogue because I know that is an 18 plus show. And then while you're booking, it shows you what times they have to offer and you have to double check and make sure you get the right one. So like Sunday, you can get September 18th at 8 p.m. or 10 p.m. And then they're also offer it on Tuesdays and Wednesdays so and, and Thursdays. So just double check your time. So I'll just pick a random day and I'll get two tickets because remember my membership is for the two tickets, but they also offer for four. And when you scroll down, you could read the little fine print about what the show is about, how old you have to be, what is allowed and not allowed. So typically recording is not allowed. And then it'll tell you like the parameters on what bags. And then it also gives you a map and directions on where it is. So clearly it says the Strat Theater. And then you scroll all the way down and you just push book once you get once you pick your time and day, you could scroll all the way down after you've done reading that and then it takes you to this and this is more fine print and then you just push I agree down here at the bottom and then you have to finalize it one last time. All right, for my 18 and over crowd, this one's for you guys. Um, this is Thunder Down Under. They perform nightly at the Excalibur. So check your house seats daily because like the shows are subject to change. Also performing here is the Australian Bee Gees. It's the same theater as Thunder Down Under. It's called the Thunderland Theater here in Excalibur. So check your house seats for these tickets. So we are here at the Luxor upstairs in the atrium showroom. It's next to the food court across the way from the Titanic. But you can also see Carrot Top. And this show is 16 years and older. Also on the rare occasion, you can go and see Blue Man Group. But again, it is a rare occasion. So be sure to just check your house seats. Who doesn't love America? 
America's Got Talent because they have an America's Got Talent live here at the Luxor next to their sportsbook and their backstage deli. So this show is super rare to come up on house seats. Usually you get it in the form of a text message, but in order to get the text messages, it is an additional cost with your membership. So just be sure to be on the lookout. So here we are at the Bally's and if you come upstairs, you will find the Magic Attic and the Magic Attic holds four different shows. The Leon's show, which is supposed to be a mind bending show, magic show mix. Then you have Feral Dylan, which is supposed to be another magic show comedy. And then on this side, you have Potted Potter, which is supposed to be 70 minutes of a parody of all of the Harry Potters put into one. And the last show that they have here to offer is Paranormal Mind Reading, whatever that means. Now I will say, Bally's is in the midst of turning into the horseshoe, so I don't know where these shows will be, if they will remain here or not, so keep that in mind. Bally's also offers Extravaganza, which is downstairs in their main lobby. Okay, so the Rio also has shows available on house seats, one of them being Wow, Rock Vault, and of course the beloved Chippendales. Wow is very much like extravaganza at the Bally's. They have different acts, acrobatic, rollerblading I know is there. I honestly don't even know how to explain it. There's so much going on, but it all leads into one storyline and it is like the coolest show ever. I definitely recommend this show. It was a lot of fun and it's family friendly. It's called Rock Vault, which is where they play live rock music and you have to be 21 and over to enter this venue guys follow my Instagram or my TikTok, then you guys know that I come to Chippendales often, but it is offered on house seats quite frequently, and I definitely recommend the show. Not only do I come here often because it's offered, but I come here often because this is one of the very few 18 and plus shows offered on house seats. House seats also offers for comedy club. This event is 21 and over though, but they have different types of comedy clubs. They have the world champion thing going on right now, and they offer three show times, six, eight, and 10. And then if you come upstairs in the stratosphere, they offer shows like the Mind Games, the Magic Show, Illuminary, and Rogue. All of those shows, well, Rogue is 18 and up. The rest of these shows are all ages. Okay, so today we're at Westgate, and Westgate also offers shows that appear on house seats. For example, Motown. So if you like soul music, Motown music, it's all here. We also have this magic show. <laughs> this magic show is always on here and this is for all ages. And then if you don't like soul music, but you like music, we have the Bronx Wanderers and they are also usually on house seats. And don't forget, I do have a referral link, so that'll be in the description below. So if you are interested in house seats to be sure to use that link when you go to sign up. Also, House Seats is available in other parts of the US, but this is just for the Vegas shows. Now you officially know every local secret to how they always go to all these different types of shows. Now, notice I said different types of shows. That's because the shows are subject to change every single day. You'll have like your common ones or like the ones that are on there all the time, but there's they offer different shows all the time. So like when I say check it, I literally mean like check House Seats all the time, constantly. Phew. What a video. All right, so <laughs> if you made it this far, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below if you guys have heard of house seats, if you guys use house seats and what your guys' experience with house seats are. Be sure to smash that subscribe button down there while you're at it. Toodles.